Do you have a Sony AX100? If you do, and would like to know how to use the CarPlay on it, stay tuned. So in order to hook up CarPlay, go ahead and take your iPhone cable and your iPhone and plug them together. The next thing you want to do is make sure your phone is unlocked. Once connected, it'll go ahead and start playing the music you were listening to. Go ahead and select the home icon, and it'll bring up the options for CarPlay. In this case, we've downloaded a couple extra apps. So we have MLB, Audible, iHeartRadio, NPR, Slacker. Now, in order to get these, these are all downloaded from the App Store, and they're on the phone themselves. They're not part of the radio. Nothing about CarPlay is actually ever stored on the radio. That's the nice thing about these, is that you can plug any phone, any time, into the radio, whether it's yours, your friends, or whatever, and they'll take over. So you get hands-free calling and texting anytime you're in the car that has a CarPlay radio. So, you have your phone, music, maps, messages, now playing, podcasts, and audiobooks are the seven basic apps that come on the phone. Now, the apps are here just to make you feel better. You actually don't have to use any of them. So by simply either pressing and holding the icon here or the button, call Fernando Lopez. Calling Fernando Lopez. We'll go ahead and select end. You can go to the phone icon. Whom shall I help you call? And she'll ask you if there's someone you'd like to call. But it's totally not necessary. The same is true for messages. You can select message. To whom should I send your message? Text Fernando Lopez. What do you want to say to Fernando Lopez? Wubba, wubba, wubba. Your messages. Wubba, wubba, wubba. Ready to send it? Send it. I'll send your message. Now you can also simply send a message by holding the button. Send a message. Who shall I text? Fernando Lopez. What do you want to say to Fernando Lopez? Oh! Your messages. Oh no. Ready to send it? Sure. I'll send your message. So when you get a message, a gray bar will appear at the top of the screen. Tap it. You have a message from Fernando. What are you talking about? Want to reply? No, thank you. Okay. Now, if you miss the gray bar on the top, let's say because you're actually driving, it's no big deal. You can simply hold the button when you get an opportunity. Read me back my last text message. I found your most recent message from Fernando Lopez. What are you talking about? Want to... Now maps are going to work very similar to this. You simply touch them and you can have your map up to where you're actually seeing what's going on. If you'd like to select a destination, select destinations. Here's a bunch of addresses that you've been to in the past. You can also choose from predetermined destinations like gas station, parking, food, coffee, grocery shopping. But if you know what you want, simply press and hold. Is there an Outback Steakhouse nearby? Okay, one option is Outback Steakhouse in Largo, which averages three stars and is moderately priced. Let me know if I should call one of them or get directions for you. So you can simply just ask her to find something specific for you, and then once you tap on it, it'll go ahead and give you the option to take you there. Now, if you're into music, you can simply press play, select back, select playlist, and scroll through your music, and then pick something to play. However, that's not conducive to actually driving down the road when you have a desire to listen to music. So simply there again, press and hold either button. Play some ACDC. 
Okay, ACDC coming up. And it'll go ahead and start playing the music. If you want to have the maps up while you're driving, you can. If you'd like to view, you can do that as well. Now let's say you just want to not listen to your iPod music, you want to listen to something else. Like let's say Pandora. Open Pandora. And it'll go ahead and start playing Pandora. From there you can select what you like. You can select now playing. Now a lot of people ask, can I have my maps up while I'm listening to the radio? Let's go back here. So we have our maps up. So let's go ahead and select home. Select tuner. We have the static of the tuner playing. Go ahead and select home. Select Apple CarPlay. And now we can have our maps up. Now if we're using the maps to actually go somewhere, it'll go ahead and chime in by turning down the FM so that it'll tell you which way to go. And that's CarPlay. How cool, right? That's really cool. I know, isn't CarPlay great? Okay, end the show. All right, so thank you for watching. You guys can find us on Facebook, YouTube, and Instagram. If you have any questions about this radio, please check out the other videos we've done on it. So like if you have Android Auto and mistakenly watch this one, watch the Android Auto video. And with that, subscribe, like, share, Bye, basically. all that fun stuff. We appreciate it a lot. Have a great night. We will see you later next time. Bye. Bye.